Hi there. Yeah, I found this squishy thing. <laughs> so much fun. Today we're gonna repaint this to look more realistic, I think. This is something I get requested to do a lot, probably because someone else has already done it. <laughs> Stop. Uh, oh. I'm pretty sure this is an off-brand one called Squeezy Dog. I don't know enough about these type of things to really know, but fair to say this is a little bit cute and a little bit terrifying. I don't know how this is gonna go. You can already see that the paint job on this one, it's not the best, it's like they literally dipped the ton. I don't know why I love this so much, but I know that I do. <laughs> it's just fun. The goal is to try to repaint him, to make him look a bit more realistic, a bit more painted well. For the materials, we have some acrylic paint, we have paint brushes and Mod Podge. I have painted on this type of material before when I painted on a giant exercise ball to make the ball into Kirby, but we'll see if this goes bad today. <laughs> if it's a fail, it's a fail. Here we go. And here we go. We're gonna paint him. I'm gonna start out by doing a light around his eyes and just try to get a base coat down. I'm mixing in a little bit of yellow and I'm also mixing in red around the edges, repainting the white areas, adding black to the mouth, little speckles to the nose, and let's paint the ton all the way in. <laughs> that has been bugging me. Now what I've done is I've stretched him out and squeezed him and I'm painting in all the cracks. I'm trying the best that I can here. Putting some little speckles of brown, little slashes of yellow, filling in the pupils. some shadows around the eyes and now we're adding some tone on the edges. I do feel silly doing this. This, this feels silly. <laughs> I am adding some darker spots inside the ear as well as some lighter ones around the edge. To go for the other side. This time I mixed in a little bit more of a mustard color. <laughs> adding the shadows again. A little bit more tone. We're trying. Am I taking myself too seriously right now? Yeah, yeah, I know I am. Adding some more detail on the mouth. And now we're gonna go over the tongue again. Add more shadows, second coat, all the good stuff, blending. <laughs> Go over the nose, clean up the lines, add some shine on the tongue, shine on the nose. Yeah, all the things. I'm repainting the iris of the eye because I didn't like how it turned out the first time. And now we're painting the whole back. Again, a solid color to start out. The base of him is going to be white. I'm blending it into a tan color. It's got quite a nice structure. <laughs> it even had little claws. Adding in some more little details. And now we have Mod Podge. I'm using Gloss Mod Podge on the ton, eyes and nose. and I'm using a matte Mod Podge on the rest of the body. <laughs> and here he is. <laughs> so here's the before and after. This was a lot of fun to do and I'd highly recommend. <laughs> it's like a creepy cute. <laughs> that, that was fun, that was very fun. You should try it. Look. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. I do have my golden pen giveaway, so please leave a nice comment down below should you like a chance to win a pen.
Hey, it's Jen. And if you could with your comment, leave suggestions of new challenges you want me to do, new stuff. Ideally for Orlando tomorrow, I'm going to be there for 10 days. Uh, I have pre-filmed one video and I have not pre-filmed the rest. I'm thinking about trying to do some collabs at Playlist Live. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, vibes. Vibes, 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 God speak. <laughs> Also, I got this for five pounds. It was in the after, after Valentine's Day sale, so that's the best time.